Hello there everyone, this is Sam, your number one source of reading news articles and gun stats so you don't have to, you lazy bastards. Yes, that's right, what would you do without me? Probably go and watch one of the thousands of other Battlefield news channels. Um, now let's move on from that to the, to the news, and for once I have a genuine real headline, no speculation, which is strange for this channel. I know you're used to seeing me bring out pure speculation, but make it sound like it's actually confirmed news. You click the video and give me the wrong coup. But actually, this is real news for a change. Battlefield 5 will be military themed. Give you a few seconds for that to sink in. Military themed. That's right, it's the biggest news since the last time I told you some really unimportant stuff about a game. But yeah, Battlefield 5 will be military themed. Who saw that coming? I did. Yes, you complained that Battlefield Hardline was different while asking for changes. You'll probably complain that this is going down the same route again now, but I'm sure it will satisfy some. What can we expect? Uh, probably military vehicles, guns. Now, to be honest, I'm not really sure what to do with real news. Um, this, is, this is different. Let's move on because I just feel like I want to speculate. So up next, those crazy cats down at Vault 101 have once again been digging into the files this time of the Battlefield Hardline beta. Yes, it really does make you think, these guys need to get a job. Otherwise, they just spend the days probably cycling between eating, going through game files, looking for something interesting, and masturbating themselves into oblivion. <laughs> but what they have found may actually knock that first headline straight out the water. Battlefield Hardline will contain guns. Now, which guns, you may ask? The ones that shoot bullets? Uh, that's, that's about all we know right now. But it will contain guns, and I'm sure you guys needed me to tell you that, and I'm sure you guys needed those crazy cats to find those files. Otherwise, you guys probably thought we would be running around, flinging our feces at each other. But actually, we will be given guns. Now next, it wouldn't be a Battlefield news channel without some crazy idea of an easter egg, and some ridiculous theory behind it, so ridiculous that I can put it in the title with confirmed with a question mark next to an exclamation mark, or vice versa. Therefore, you will think this is actually confirmed. Click the video, and the Ronku will just rain down upon me. But this relates to Operation Metro, and this specific vehicle here. Now you'll notice, if you shoot the horn on the car, it doesn't make a normal horn sound, it makes this sound. Was that a clown horn, I hear you ask? Yes. Yes, it was. Now, I don't think this relates to Battlefield 4, because we have all the DLCs now. I think, and just, just follow me on this. This is on Operation Metro. Operation Metro has a train line. A train line is made of steel. Steel is hard. Hard line. Battlefield hard line. That's right guys. Remember where you were the day you heard this. I am the first person to announce that for Battlefield Hardline 2015, clown cars confirmed. Now no one knows what this clown car will look like, but here are some ideas, some concepts. And it is going to be quite a good vehicle. When you start it up, it won't make the usual engine startup sound. It's supposedly going to be more of a... <laughs> uh, so I really can't wait to give, give this a try. Apparently it will fit 12 people in it, despite having only two doors. So based on no evidence alone, I'm going to say that this is... Confirmed? Confirmed. So, that's all the news for today. Plenty of speculation for you there. I think I probably need to go and look up the definition of news before I go and make another video. But next, I'm going to actually bring you some variation. In the next video, I'm going to do some weapon reviews. Granted, from the same game, but instead of reading news sites and Reddit, I'll be reading gun stats. That's right, my GCSE English is really coming in handy to bring in the Ronku. So, if you did enjoy the video, hit like, leave a comment. Please, I want the Ronku to rain down on me. Because I want to buy me some new PC parts. But until next time, this has been Sam, wondering why you're still watching these kind of videos.